Hello, I'm Paul Whitfield. I'm the Director General of Wildwood and we can't wait to welcome you back on the 12th of April when we're allowed to finally reopen again after this really long lockdown period. We've taken lots of steps to make sure that you can have a safe and fantastic experience once you're able to come back. When you arrive here at the entrance, please make sure you're wearing a face mask or a face covering. You can remove it once you're through the entranceway and out into the fresh air of the park. When you arrive, we are going to have to take details of the name and contact details of every visitor over the age of 16. It's a new government rule, so it's something we have to comply with. Alternatively, you can scan the NHS QR codes on your phone when you arrive. Members of staff will be wearing face shields and face masks when interacting with our visitors. So if you're a member, please, please remember to bring your membership card with you. It'll make it much faster when you arrive. If you can't find your card, bring some ID with you and we'll get you through the queue as soon as you possibly can. So don't forget, if you're not a member already, you can join online and become a member. Or alternatively, you can join when you come to the park. It's the cheapest way to get in and see the animals, but also it's the best way you can help the charity. So when you arrive, please bring the printout of your timed booking or the email on your phone to show us to make sure that we can get you through the queue as quickly as possible. Please try to use contactless payments wherever you possibly can. So when you get to Wildwood, we're going to ask everyone to follow our new one-way system to make sure that everyone's moving in the same way and not crossing paths. So when you first get here, follow the one-way signs and head off in that direction. So with the one-way system, it's really important that you don't go through the no-entry signs. If you follow the one-way system, you will get to see all of the animals in the park. So all of our indoor spaces are going to have to be closed, including our cafe. However, you will be able to get takeaway food and drinks from our kiosk and eat it in our socially distanced picnic area. All around the park, you'll find additional hand sanitizers, so please make use of those and make sure you wash your hands whenever you possibly can. So we've got multiple hand washing stations around the park, so please make use of them when you get the opportunity to. So because our cafe is closed, we've opened up an additional takeaway kiosk here where you'll be able to get hot drinks, ice creams and cold drinks as you walk around the park. So we're keeping the Bear Bridge open, it's a one-way system, but we are asking people to socially distance while they're using it. So our wolf platform, we've had to close the downstairs area because it's an enclosed space, but the upstairs will be open. We're asking people to follow a one-way system so you can go and see the wolves in a safe way. So around the park, you'll see these signs. Obviously, we're not doing our usual animal talks because they gather quite large crowds. However, if you use the QR code on these signs, you'll be able to watch an animal talk for this animal on your device if you've got a signal. So we've brought in some additional temporary toilets and you'll find these near the exit and up by the bears to make sure that we've got plenty of facilities for everyone in a nice socially distanced way. The Wildwood shop is going to be closed until mid-May, but don't worry, you'll still be able to pick up a selection of gifts and souvenirs when you arrive and when you leave, and also there'll be a selection of amazing goodie bags for sale. So last summer, when we were able to be open, we tried a new thing. We tried opening in the summer evenings and they were a huge success, so we'll be doing them again. From the 14th of May, we will be open from 6 p.m. till 9 p.m every Friday and Saturday. These evenings are for over 16s and they're a really peaceful and unique way to experience the park. And a great opportunity to see some of those shire animals which you might not see during the day when it's noisy and busy. The cafe will be serving hot meals and we have an alcohol license too. So it's a great opportunity to have a meal and a glass of wine on a beautiful summer's evening. You can book your evening visit on the website now. So we're setting up a temporary exit as well. So please don't exit through the shop, but follow the signs and we'll make sure you can get back to your car safely. So hopefully that all makes sense. We hope you have a wonderful time at Wildwood. We can't wait to welcome you back.